Well, this next story, it just isn't right. Only on five, stranded at the altar. A limo company in Cleveland accused of leaving couples high and dry on their wedding days, taking their deposits and then taking off. News 5's Megan Hickey is tracking down the answers for it. And Megan, we're talking thousands of dollars in losses here. One couple paid $1,200 to reserve limos for the bachelor parties and the big day, but they never dreamed that the cars would never show up. It was a gorgeous September wedding in Parma with one hitch. I was very confused on how somebody could do that to you, especially on your big day. Maid of Honor Krista Osborne and the groom Chad Novak ordered three separate limousines from Aqua Limo. The owner took their deposits, had them sign a contract, and told them everything was set for the big day. Come to find out, just took our money and went on his way. Dozens of calls and emails went unanswered. He changed his phone number. We couldn't get in contact with him. His number was out of service. And the address listed on the website turned out to be a storage company. But they soon learned that they weren't the only couples left in the dust. The Better Business Bureau has received 19 complaints in the last three years with eerily similar stories. The groom, the groomsman, the parents, the ring bearer, everybody was stranded at the hotel because the limo never showed up to take them to the church. Not only did the company fail to respond to our repeated requests for an interview, they're not talking to anyone. The company does not even respond to us any longer about their customer complaints. The wedding party is still fighting to get their deposits back and hoping that their story will serve as a warning. It, that's a nightmare. And for anyone else for the future, if you've booked with them, I mean, I would hate for this to happen to them. And the Aqualimo has an F rating with the Better Business Bureau, which says that the last seven complaints from customers have gone unanswered. In the studio, Megan Hickey, News 5.